Oh, thanks to Leon for that first Moore's Millions race. And this is the 4 mile 2 version this week. It's a maiden and it's four and a quarter miles. And at the top, we've got Captain Manor in for Martin Lidham, Gran Torino, Paul Rhodes, Maggie Saucier for OB1, Zami Thinkar, Graham Clutterbuck, that was placed in the national last season, Castle Donington, Darren Thompson, Ello, Ello, Lola for Padre Hogan, and Fire Memorial for Leon Van Rensburg. So seven in this then, and I think four places in the final for grabs, sir. And where they go. There's always a lot more qualified for these finals that never take place and part in them, though, sir. Good to get your four miler qualified for the final at this early stage. And I think the two of these should be nailed on for that. Zami think I was placed in the Grand National last, last season as they get over the second and all over that nicely. And also just to steer people clear on, I made a bit of a mistake last week. I said you've got to run twice over four miles to qualify for the Nationals. They get over the third, you've only got to run once over four miles but you've got to run three times altogether. So, that's the qualification rules for getting in the SO7 Grand National come the end of the season. So past the winning post then with three circuits of the track still to go and Gran Torino is clearing the lead by about two and a half lengths to Captain Mannerin and Castle Donington in LOLA Lola to that one and then Fire Memorial Zami Thinker and finally Maggie Saucier and the leader there Gran Torino took a bit of a liberty with that one and got away with it uh, quite a few of these trainers in this are quite good at these long distance races on the roads on the Grand National a few years ago and second place was Captain Manor in Martin Little was the winner of the Grand National last year and Leon Van Rensburg, he's also in there, he's won the National in the past, and Darren Thompson certainly come close if he hasn't won it, and Zami Thinker, off a grand principle, actually was placed last year, so always gone this time, the leader, he took one or two liberties earlier on, and Gran Torino just didn't jump high enough to get over that one, and Gran Torino is out, so hopefully Paul Rhodes has got another jumper that's maybe a little bit safer on its feet, for the national letter in the season, but they're all over the sixth. And LO, LA Lola, and Captain Manor in a dispute in the lead with Fire Memorial and Castle Donington. It's almost four a line as they take this ditch. And Castle um, Captain Mannerin was the one who made a mistake in the leading group. And towards the back, Maggie Saucier also was a little bit untidy. They've negotiated seven of the 27. We've already lost one, and we could easily have lost another two. So, the first four, as we said, will qualify for the final in week 13 as they get to the eighth. Uh, they're all safely over that one. All jumped in okay with Fire Memorial now, just the leader from LOLA Lola in the second, and then Captain Manor in third. Castle Donington on the outside is fourth, then Zami Thinkar is in fifth, and Maggie's Saucier is just the back marker. That fence nine then. And again, Maggie Saucier was a little bit untidy at the back. Dove at it a little bit, but is still on her feet as they get to number 10. And they're all safely over that one. With Captain Mannerin and Fire Memorial just about disputing the lead. From Castle Donington as they come and take the 11th. Saucier jumped that one much better. So we've got two complete circuits to go. And Captain Mannerin is in the lead. By about a length of just pulling away a little bit there as they pass the winning post with two circuits to go then. Captain Mannerin in the lead. Hello, hello, Lola on the yellow and the black in second on the inside. Zami Thinkar moving around the outside in third. Then Maggie Saucier is just getting a little bit closer as well. Castle Donington and Fire Memorial just being given a bit of a breather dropped to the rear no more than three or four lengths off the lead it's a real tactical affair this one like nothing really going on as they get over the 12th and captain mannering and lola lola on castle donington on the outside of four of all maggie saucy between them in the yellow and then zami thinker at the back the red, white, and green of Grand Clutterbuck. And 
is Captain Mannerin in the lead just from LOLA Lola. And Castle Dorrington is going to join those two as they skip over number 13. Captain Mannerin jumping that one just the better and has landed three quarters of a length in front. From LOLA Lola second. Still no more than four lengths between the whole field as they get to the next. Captain Mannerin a bit slow this time and LA Lola just jumped into the lead. The final more will now come up the inside as well and it's almost LA LA Lola in front and then the rest of them in a line as they take that ditch which was the 15th of the 27 that they've got to negotiate. And nothing has really put its authority on the race yet there. Bowling a lot, a sensible pace, nothing made a move. There's still a long way to go, of course. But nothing seems all that keen to make it a true test of stamina and go off in the lead. Once they get to the next, and it's Captain Mannerin that landed just in front of LOLA Lola. Five more than the Blue Jacket is third, then Maggie Saucy down on this near side, and the yellow is fourth. The maroon and white sleeves of Castle Donington on that one's outside, and then Zami Thinker. In the red, green, and white at the back. They're just starting to get a little bit more spread out now as they get to the next. And Captain Mannering jumped that one nicely and leads by two lengths now to Fire Memorial in second. Castle Donington's now third. LOLA Lola dropped back to fourth. Maggie Saucier is after that one as they get over number 18. And Captain Mannering jumping well and making a length of fence at the moment as they come down to the next one. Got over that one nicely as well. Fire Memorial is second. That will be the final fence of my next circuit. And Captain Mannering is two and a half lengths clear of Fire Memorial in second. And Castle Donington to length back in third. Then after that one, LAA Lola. And then Maggie Saucier. And finally, Zami Thinker as the field do now start to just get strung out a little bit. They're in true Indian fog. And Captain Mannering. He's in the lead. On Fire Memorial second. Castle Donington third as they come to the next. And all jump that nicely. Coming down to the final mile now of this four mile race, and Captain Manor is just a length or so clear of Fire Memorial in second. There's a gap of two lengths then to Castle Donington, and a gap of two or three more to LOLA Lola. Marin takes his next one in the lead. Five more over its second. These two are a good three lengths clear of Castle Donington. Hello, hello, Lola. Let's just switch around the outside of that one. And Maggie Saucier and finally Zami Thinker. Oh, we know that one stays because it was placed in the national. Over that one they go. And now Five more has just taken it up from Captain Mannerin in second, who's been pushed along to move back alongside. Fire Memorial, these two are three lengths clear as they take this ditch. Quicker jump again by Fire Memorial, now three quarters of a length clear of Captain Mannerin in second. Then comes LOLA Lola, then Castle Donington. Zami Thinker is now making a forward move. Maggie Saucier is the back marker. But it's Fire Memorial in front. By about a length from Captain Mannerin. And Zami Thinker was moving to third. This is the fourth last and Fire Thinker really, Fire Memorial really got over that one nicely. And he's now beginning to pull away. He's quickly put four lengths between himself and Captain Manor, and who's starting to tread water. It's Fire Memorial then now gone six clear. Fire Memorial six, seven, maybe even eight lengths clear as they come down towards the final three fences. It looks like Fire Memorial's just going to stand up to win. He pops over to third last. Captain Manor is over in seconds, a beaten horse. Then Zami Thinker's third. Captain Donington is after that one. Then Hello and hey Lola, and finally Maggie Saucier over the second last goes Fire Memorial. He's clear by ten lengths from in second place. Now Zami Thinker as Captain Mannerin is beginning to tire. They come to the final fence, and Fire Memorial skips over it. He's well clear. Zami Thinker is running on nicely in second. Also Captain Point and running to third. Captain Mannerin is beginning to struggle now back in fourth. Then Hello and hey Lola, and finally Maggie Saucier. But up towards the line, it's Fire Memorial, an easy winner from Zami Thinker second. Captain Warrington third, Captain Manor in four, then LOLA Lola, and finally Maggie's Saucier. So, 
I mean, I've got one for the National Eight. It won that one pretty easily. And on a form line through last year's place to Zami Thinker, you'd think it'd be right up there with a chance. So Farmer Memorial takes it for Leon Van Rensburg, Zami Thinker for Graham Clutterbuck was second, Castle Donington, Darren Thompson third, Captain Mannering, Martin Little was fourth, and L.O.L.A. Lola for Padraig Hogan was fifth. <laughs> 